what does that say? What does that say? It didn't say shit, dude. More and more church billboards. Not living up to their potential. They're telling you about some future event. As if you'll fucking go. Right, right, right! I should be inspired by the message to go. Okay, Vortex. I'm really tired right now, so I'm singing so I don't fall asleep. You might not agree with this tactic, but I sure as shit do, so fuck you. I'm having fun being me. I'm trying different stuff. Obviously. I'm trying different voices and tactics to explain myself. Ways that I haven't before. Maybe I have, I just don't remember at least not that. No, you played this one. You definitely, you played it this way too. But it does feel no when I do it, probably because I'm a pretty random person, I know this, but other people have confirmed this in my audience, when they watch me, they don't know what to expect from me, that's pretty cool, cause everybody is so predictable, so reliably boring, they just do the same thing. All the time, yes they do, you know, that is true, you probably do, just as they do. Doesn't everybody have one of those Death Star phones? That's what I call them, because they're demonic. And it's really sad that society has done this to itself, subconsciously, but then consciously. And everybody knows damn well how annoying it is. Yeah, everybody knows how terrible, 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 terrible it motherfucking is. But they just accept it. And maybe several ways they reject it. Culture, 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 culture. There are so many cultures out there. But yours truly don't feed them. Why would we feed them? That just adds to their ego and a few. Why would you want to do that? Then that seemed counterproductive. But I guess nothing matters to them. Anymore, 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 anymore. Did it ever matter before? Probably not, probably not. Just accept. Just accept, just accept that. Sorry, I didn't realize the camera was shaking this whole time. I feel like I need to open up the window because I'm about to fucking die, dude. You have the heat blasted. Why do you have the heat blasted, dude? Turn that shit down. Turn it off. Don't be swerving all over the damn road. Dude, I can't fucking see, man. Did y'all see that shit? It's just fog. This fog is, is fucking scary, dude. It's all right. We got through it. We got through it. <laughs> That's the most important thing, okay? Yeah, so this is why I don't need a man. This is why I don't need like any friends or anything like that. I do have people in my life that mean a lot to me and, and I think I mean a lot to them as well. Um, different people that I've met, different areas of my life, whether it be work or, you know, my my family. I don't even get along with my... Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I 
can't stop right now. I mean, holy shit. Okay. Ooh. I got a little too excited about that. Okay, now we can do it. <laughs> I like how you almost stopped in like the middle of the intersection. Like you were like really fucking up there, dude. It's all right. It's all right. I'm so fucking tired, dude. What if I'll go to bed though? I'm guessing I won't. Even though I'm really tired, it doesn't matter because whenever I get home, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Well, what were you about to say though? Oh, you were talking about people. Yeah, a lot of people matter to me. Oh, I was saying that, like, I don't even get along with my family, but I love them so much, you know? They mean a lot to me. As they should, because they're family. So even if you, you don't, you know, really get along with them, it's like you still just accept that they are what, whatever they are because they're family, you know? So it's like a loyalty thing. And I feel that way towards people I work with too, like they feel like family in a way and I also feel like that towards certain comics because, um, oh fuck you, 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 and still fuck you, Amy, it's not as big of a deal as you might get up to be. Nobody will hate the state as much as me and the Amish, okay? I've really been considering, like, just becoming Amish. In, in case you haven't been watching my recent content, I've been talking a lot about them. Um, I'm just jealous of them. I just think it's really cool what they're doing. But, you know, I kind of have to stay on the path that I'm on because this is the path that God wants me to be on. Otherwise, he would have put me in the Amish community, you know? That's how I see it. Now, say some, some Amish boy met me in Rumspring. <laughs> like, they just happened to be out and I was there wherever he, wherever he was. And he like fell in love with me or something. I don't know. But <laughs> wouldn't he be like 16? Isn't that when that shit starts or is that 18? Still, that's really fucking young, dude. That's a little too young. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's, I feel like that's my only entry into the Amish community. <laughs> I wonder if that happens where like somebody during Rum Spring meets somebody in that in like the 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 Eng somebody English, that's what they call people that are like of the world, like people that have chosen the modern world. Yes, this modern crappy crap industrialized, commercialized, bullshit, artificial world. Um <laughs> yes. I wonder if like like an Amish person meets somebody and then like takes them back to the Amish community. That would be really cool. Interesting. <laughs> that sounds like the, like the love story. The chick flick that was never written. That I will never write either because I don't have the motivation. Nor the, the level of cheese. Because there's so much cheese required in chick flicks. I'm not a cheesy person. Do you you're talking about actual cheese? Because I love the fuck out of actual cheese. Anyway, I don't remember what I was saying. You have a lot of people in your lives that mean the world to you. Yeah, they do. They really do. They have no idea. But it, yeah, I don't. I don't remember what my original point was about that though. talking with you for text it always is um, I don't need this I do this because it's God's will God wants me to put myself out there world in the world I really don't want to I really hate this it's terrible I'd rather just be with myself and the Lord honestly but um, you know we must do what we must do and uh, unfortunately the internet 
my little telephone on a string deal.